Hello you guys! <laughs> if I seem kind of frustrated or rushing throughout the video, long story short, this is my fourth time trying to film this. It was light when it was when I started this and well, I'll have all that in the info box if you guys want to read it because I am just really frustrated by it and I'm pretty sure I think my roommate's in his room I'm pretty sure that he thinks I'm I'm going crazy because I'm sure he thinks I'm talking to myself and yeah so I'm just gonna get this started uh, if you follow me on tumblr which I'll link down below I posted that I got a decent sized elf haul probably one of mm, I don't know probably one of my biggest that I've done from there and I spent $46 and I got a free GeoGlam collection bag thing that if you go to their website, it's eyeslipsface.com, if you go to the top, I believe it should still be there, or, you know, actually, I think, today's the 2nd of October, I think it actually ended September 30th, so I don't think you can get it for free, now you can still buy it there for $26, but I got it for free because I used the coupon code. And then I got four lip glosses, which was kind of weird, but I will explain that in a bit. Um, I won't be doing any swatches. If you want to see any swatches of the lip colors or the eyeshadows or anything like that, because I have quite a bit of them, um, just comment down below or um, go to my Tumblr and shoot me an ask or a message. And yeah, I will film that for you guys and I will... Hopefully this will work, and so I'll know what to do next time so that it doesn't get messed up, so I can just do it, and let it do it when it's light outside, so I can actually get some, like, the actual correct colors for you guys, so you guys can actually see what they look like. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get started, and I will start off with their, I got their 11-piece studio brush set. And the studio brushes are each $3, and I got this as 11 brushes with a little travel kit for $30, so that was pretty good. And then you open it up, and it looks like this, and I just got it today, so it also has like the protective covers, the plastic to keep the panel looking nice, and the, this little thing to keep the brush looking good. And I have their enti entire essentials line, and they're all, they're, okay brushes but I wanted to try these out because all the YouTubers that use e.l.f. that I watch uh, say that the studio is a lot better and even just now I haven't actually used them but they're a lot softer so hopefully they will work better because there's like the essentials blush brush is kind of scratchy and not that great so like this one this one's their complexion brush it's just a big fluffy brush and this one feels nice and soft so we'll see how those all go and it came out of this thing, you know, it keeps doing that every time I do it. But yeah, so, just looks like this on the inside. It comes with a little, little fold-out booklet thing. And it has the pictures of all the brushes, and if you can't tell from the pictures, which ones they are, every handle of the brushes has the name of the brush on them. And it comes with the Complexion Flat Top Powder Angled Foundation Fan Blush Concealer Contour Eyeshadow C Small Precision Small Smudge Small and Small Angled Brushes. I already have their flat top powder brush from their um, studio line, which looks like this. Oops, and there's my phone. And yeah, it looks like this. And I was using it during the summer for my tinted moisturizers because I'm blind most of the time and so I know if I didn't I would wind up splotchy but lately I've been using it for my uh, Physicians Formula Pressed Middle Foundation and it works great for that so yeah that's pretty much all there is to that and like I said each one normally if you buy them by themselves is three dollars so the entire set like this entire thing was thirty so it's pretty good and I will move on to their mineral Lip, I got mostly lip products from the stuff that I, or I got all lip products and the stuff from my bought. So I'll start with the mineral stuff. And the first thing I got, and like I said before, this is my fourth time recording, so I've already opened the boxes. But this is what it, the box looks like. This is for their matte lip color from their studio line, and I got the color in rich red. So the box looks like that, and then the actual tube looks like this. It's just black and long and skinny. Shows the color at the bottom. Says the color like on a sticker, on the very bottom of the tube. You the cap and it's a twist up 
and it looks like that, but it's black outside so you guys won't be able to see it very clearly, but it looks like that. And then, ah, put the cap back on, you take off the bottom, it's got a sharpener so if you want to try and, um, if you don't like using lip brushes to try and get like really precise in the corners, you can just sharpen it and all that fun stuff. And then also from their studio line, I got their lip lock pencil. And the reviews on the site were kind of mixed. There were a lot of people who said it made it their lipstick last longer. There's some people who said that it shortened the wearing time of their lipsticks, which doesn't make sense to me because on the site you can go for every product and there's an instructions tab and it tells you how to use it. And then on the back it says that you're supposed to, and also on the back of the thing, there's my phone again, you're supposed to put it right outside your natural lip line because here's the tube, it looks the same as their the matte lip color and it's just black on the bottom oh and it also has a sharpener i did not realize that before but as you can see it's just this clear and it's like waxy so you're just supposed to put it on the outside and it's mostly supposed to prevent feathering which i only got this because like all my lip colors that i got were darker because i only went on the side originally because i have no color the colors for fall but yeah and so it's just you're supposed to put it like right outside your lips so it'll stop it from feathering which doesn't make sense as to what how it could possibly shorten the time that you can wear your lipstick compared to when it's by itself. Because I think what I think they're doing is like they're doing what people do now with like lip liners, where they line their lips and fill them in, and it helps keep their lipstick on longer. But it's, it's not what you're supposed to do with this. <laughs> so I'll try it out and I'll see how it works, and hopefully it'll work well. And then I got two of their mineral lipsticks, and the boxes look like this. They're white. And on the very top of the bar, it shows the color. And I got them in Cheerful Red and Beautiful Berry. And the actual tubes look like this. They're just black and they are square. They say up at the top. They got the name at the bottom. And then they're both similar colors. Like even on the website, they both they look similar. But I wanted one that was more purpley colored. And so this one's Cheerful Cherry. And it's just a red color. And they're pointed, so that's nice. And then this one, I think the little twist thing's messed up, so I gotta be kind of careful when I switch up. This is Beautiful Berry, and it's similar, but it's more of a purpley shade. I'm not gonna do swatches, like I said. If you want to see swatches, just leave a comment, and I'll probably do it. Probably do it anyways, but yeah. So, before I move on to the stuff I got in the Geo Glam thing, um... They bagged each one separately. Like they bagged the Geo Glam stuff in one big bag, I like this big old bag, and then the stuff that I bought was all in a slightly smaller bag. But in the bag with the stuff that I bought were these four Hyper Shine lip glosses, and there's two in Bubble Gum and two in Berry Cherry, and I already had one that I. And these are from the Essentials line, and I got one in the color Flirt, I think. And I like the way it wears, and I like the color, but I don't understand why I got these. Like, why they were sent to me. Like, I don't know if someone just, like, messed up and accidentally put them in the bag, but it's kind of weird because there's two of each color. I have no idea. But, um, yeah. Like, since I know sometimes they'll send you products if, like, you order something, especially if you order quicker shipping, they'll send you other items if one of the items you ordered is out of stock or they run out of stock before they can bag yours and it's like sometimes they'll send you a free item that says like hey sorry that what we what you ordered was out of stock here's something else and I think they send once they come back in stock with the item you ordered then they send that to you also and they kind of send you the free stuff and at first to kind of like hold you off but I already checked the like the Geo Glam stuff and I believe everything that the website says that there is is in there, so I'm not sure. But I got those, and I'll try them out, and I'll see how much I like the colors. I already know I like the formula, unless the color formula is slightly different for each color, but yeah. I just gotta try out the colors, I guess. So I guess I will, <laughs> I guess, I guess, I guess, I will just continue on with the stuff that came in the Geo Glam bag, and this is where... My videos keep stopping recording and all that junk, but so we'll see how far we get this time. But first thing that was in there is this elf, they call it their dump bag, just so you can store all your makeup, 
and I think pink is the only color it comes in, so I'm totally okay with that, otherwise I would've, or, it was also free, I'm not gonna complain. By the way, like I said, I think I said before, all the stuff that I bought was $46. I think the Geo Glam bag, I believe you can still buy it, you just can't get it free with the coupon code that they were using. But it's $26 on the website, and you'll see all the stuff that you get with it. But, yeah, so, here's the duck bag, and I think this alone is like $8 or something like that. It's like, I don't know, I want to say it's about $8. I don't have the site pulled up, so, yeah, it's just bigger pouch, and it's got a little regular pouch on one side, and then a zippered pouch on the other side, so there's that. You can just store your brushes, or if you're traveling and you're taking a lot of makeup, do what you want. And then, how did I do this the first time? And then this came with a, another eyeshadow C brush, and so now I have two of those, which is nice. So now I have four of like the regular eyeshadow brushes total. And I like eyeshadow brushes, so, yeah. And now I'm rambling. But, um, what else did I come with? See, now that I'm looking at it, I'm feeling like I'm missing something from it, but I don't think so. But I have the liquid eyeliner in black, which I like. It's actually the only, I guess I can't really say whether I, like, love it or not, because it's the only liquid eyeliner I've ever tried. And I thought that I was happy when I went and ordered it because I thought I ran out of my other one so I couldn't find it. And then I was doing my makeup for the video today and I found it. So now I just have a backup, I guess. So th And this is from their Essentials line. So it's only a dollar and it's pretty good. So if you've never tried liquid liner and you want something cheap that you know is going to work, you can try this, get it at Target. It's a dollar and yeah, it's all good. Then I also came with the Waterproof Lengthening and Volume Mascara. I'm not opening this one either because I already have a tube of this that I'm currently working on. And I don't know if there's more than two mascaras. I haven't re really looked. But I've tried two e.l.f. mascaras and I think this is the one that I like out of the two. Because the other one I had was like a tube where it looked like this. So it was just a tube where this one, these ones, it tapers so like it's like skinny on one end and bigger on the other like the handle skinny or whatever so I think this is the one I like the other one was probably in essentials or something I don't know I got it in a kit like at Sears or something and I think it was just lengthening and it just smudged and it was probably not waterproof which is why and it was terrible and so like this one's okay if it's what I'm thinking of if it's the one I have right now it's like kind of sticky but that formula, it just might be old because I've had it for a year or so now. So, when I open this one, I'll see if it's any better. Because that one might just be old. I don't know. But this is in the color... It's in black. Yeah. And then it also came with this eyeshadow primer. And it's from the Essentials line. So it's only a, it's only a dollar. And this one... Yeah, this is from the studio, this mascara. So I think the other one might have been from the essentials line, I'm not sure. But this is their Essentials Eyelid Primer. I have their one from the studio line and it's like a stick, but it doesn't blend very well and it's kinda, I don't know, it's just like too sticky if that makes sense and it makes, I can't blend my eyeshadows very well. But one of my favorite YouTubers, I'll link her down below because you guys should check her out, uses this one and says she loves it so maybe since it's more liquidy it'll work better for me, I don't know. But we will see, but it's in the color sheer if it comes in more than one color. And then I have these individual, I have this individual lash kit. It comes with 18 individual lashes and glue. And I've gotten their, um, it's my mistake, it was my very first time ever buying false lashes, but I got their VIP lashes and they were just, they're pretty intense and they're very plasticky. And that came with the its own glue too. But I've never tried the glue because I never tried those lashes because they were just too dramatic. I couldn't ever find the time to wear them. I was going to try them once so I could at least see what they look like on. And I don't know what happened to them. They like got crumpled or something. Like I think, I don't know how they ended up in one of my drawers but they just got crumpled and messed up. And so I don't know if the glue actually works but I'll practice with these a little bit and I will try the glue off. It doesn't work but I like the lashes. I have my own lash glue that I have so... Yeah, we'll see about that. And then, 
See, now I've got myself thinking, like, now I really think there's something missing, but I don't know. I'll put it in the description bar if I was missing anything and what it was missing, and yeah. But I got this six-piece eyeshadow palette. I haven't opened it yet because I forgot to open it before I filmed it the first time and just haven't filmed it any other time afterwards. And it's, pretty sure I already said it already, but six pieces and it's more neutral colors, like if you can see at all, not really. It's got four shimmery shades and then two matte ones and the matte ones are kind of a t like a light taupey color and a cream. And then the shimmery ones that I can explain to you, there's a black, gold, there's kind of a silvery color, like a bronzy silvery, and then there's like a bronzy gold. Yeah, there's those, and it comes with those little eyeshadow sponges that no one uses. So, yeah, there's that. And then, and yeah, these are their studio um, eyeshadows. So, so, I've heard that their essentials ones aren't that great, and I thought these were going to be the essentials ones. That's what it looked like in the picture, but... These are the studio ones, so I'll see how those work. Because I have a couple other eyeshadow palettes, but I'm pretty sure that they're studio, but I don't know, so we will find out. It also comes with this geometric eyeshadow book, and it looks like this. And then it opens like a book. Oh, it's got a mirror. It's a pretty decent mirror. It's like, I don't know, when I first was looking at it, I thought it was like pink tinged. I thought it was weird, but I think I was just in. Like something was reflecting off of something else, like, I don't know. But it comes in these little, I keep wanting to call them quads, but there's six in each one, like six colors in each one, but, so it's like six, can't talk, six little sets, and one's kind of like a greeny color, where am I, a greeny color, and then there's like a pinkish one, and then there's like four brown ones, like one's, I want to say like this one's more warmy tone because there's a gold in there. This one's more cool tone because there's like silvery colors, so silvery brown kind of colors. And this one seems to be more of a neutral one because it's all browns. It doesn't lean, doesn't really lean gold or silver. And then this one it just kind of has, I don't know, it's got like a shimmery olive one, and it's got some grays and a cream and a brown. So you know, they're just kind of folly colors. Like if you go on the site, it says that they're all like. I'm covering the wrong side, it's all mirrored. It says that they're all, like this whole Geo Glam thing is supposed to be fall inspired or something, so I guess that explains that. But yeah, I believe that is everything. Yeah, I will go onto the site and I'll look at their Geo Glam thing and see if something was missing, if they were out of stock of something that, that was in the Geo Glam collection, and if that's why I got the lip glosses, but I'll put that down below. Yeah, thank you for watching. Again, if you want to see any swatches of anything, I have like I have a lot of lip products and eyeshadows. I can swatch those for you guys if you guys want to see them. Um, definitely check out the site. I'll link it down below. They have free shipping automatically on any orders over $35. And definitely sign up for their emails because, yeah, they, they kind of send a lot of emails, but like every week they have new... Um, coupon codes coming out and so it's kind of worth it I mean like sometimes they even have it where it's like 50% off their like everything from their studio line so that's pretty cool and yeah I will talk to you guys later probably bye